Everyone, Darkness of the Stars here, and welcome back to Delicious, Delicious Dreamland, or our Pokemon Spork mini episode. In last episode, we got our two Pokemon, the Shiny Mareep and the Dang um, Lickitung. In today's episode, oh, and we also got lost. In today's episode, I finally figured out where we need to go, so what well, we need to do, so let's get to it. Come right here. You push the button and vanilla ice cream. I guess that vanilla wanted to play a prank on someone. <laughs> it seems to like you, so why not take it with you? You keep it out of trouble or join in on its fun, whichever you prefer. Vanilla. All right, we're just gonna call you gelato. It seems like that the vanilla dragged some drinks down with it. You can take them out if you want. Fresh water, awesome. Soda pop and a lemonade. So let's check out our level 100 on Vanillaite. Special attack. Come on, hail Miracle Blizzard Shoot Cold. Nah. Move we learn. We need to go and talk to you. Alright, so let's get moving on. Glad to finally have figured out where we need to go. Alright, let's get this thing some better moves, then. Ooh, Icicle, Icicle Spear's not that bad, but we're not a physical attacker. So we're gonna give it Ice Beam and Mirror Shot, for now, and we'll see what it can learn from our TMs. Get rid of... Sheer... Actually... Yeah, Sheer Cold. I was gonna say, let's keep it, because we're level 100 and... All that stuff, but then, remember, yeah, everybody's level 100. Alright, so... Got it, Ice Beam now. Um, we will now give it Mirror Shot. And place a Mirror Coat. Alright, now let's see what TMs this thing can learn. Maybe Flash Cannon? Oh my god, it can. Wow. Well, let's get rid of Hail then. With two steel moves, I'm fine with that. Can it get psychic? No. What about thunderbolt. No. Um, shadow ball. I feel like I could learn. No. Dazzling gleam. We'll try that. Nope. All right. Well, I'm sticking with those for now. Oh, hello. Where'd you come from? I was sure the coast was clear. I was hoping I could just sneak in, but... Oh, tourist trespasser. Oh boy, here we go, guys. Somebody's trying to get into the... Party zone. There we go. Oh, oh dear. Should've probably used power with the start. There we go, should be dead. Thank you, Tonger. Tonger! Why do you suck so? Bye, Tonger. I didn't like you anyways. This is why we need a licky licky. Alright, gelato. We're gonna use ice beam. Probably just gonna kill us with earthquake. I hate having baby mons. How would you expect this to like out speed with only baby mons? Gyro ball. Gyro Ball against the one thing it has the super effective moves on. Execute. Got single beam for that. Four times super effective. Stop it. Nice. Down to the execute, leaving the Sir Skip. Which is easy. Yes! Thunderbolt saved us. I should leave. I won't give up on my quest to see what the party district is like, but it's time to retreat for now. So what, we go back in now? Go to the party district. No. Oh. 
Welcome back, Alicia. How'd I go? Did the Kachong enjoy the city? I see. You went with one friend and came back with two more. You're making new friends everywhere you go. You must. You just met the Kachong a week ago, and you got three Pokemon already. That's amazing. I hope everyone will love it here. You've had lots of adventures today, so why not rest so your new friends can get situated? Okay. In the past week, sh the past week sure has been eventful, and the one coming up will be too. Are you nervous about doing your first magic show? A little. But I've been practicing a lot, so I'm confident. I won't mess up too badly. I'm sure you'll do fine, sweetie. You have everyone on stage cheering for you. Mm-hmm. I'll do my best to make sure that happens. A few days later. Good morning, Delisha. What? We don't have a swirl. Swirl, so we have a marine. I'm going somewhere today, and I was wondering if you'd like to come with me. Huh? It's magic related. It's not something I'll be able to do at the show, but I want to see if I can anyways. Out of curiosity, there's only one place I can go to test this. Dark Dungeon. Would you like to come with me? I need a volunteer for this, so I'd really appreciate it. But I wouldn't force you if you'd rather not. Great. Just let me know when you're ready to go then. Delisha gathered up her Pokemon and headed to Dark Dungeon with Felicia. So here's what's going to happen. I want to see if I can use magic related to the environment I'm in. Darkrai lives in this cave, so I thought dreams might be a fun place to start. I'm going to try to get you to dream. Are you still on board? Mm-hmm. Great, let's see if this works then. We're in our dreams now. Oh, and she just heals up. Wait, what? Lemonade Drinker wants the battle. Uh-oh. <laughs> What's with the level? <laughs> Why? What is this ghost lord doing? <laughs> With the winner. Welcome to Aether Paradise, the Aether Foundation's own private island. I'm the president of the foundation, but please, just call me Lucimine. I'm so glad that we got to meet. The vending machine has been defeated. Oh, so we have to defeat the vending machines then? With the Whalmers. <laughs> oh, that's a Whalmers. What is this? <laughs> Lily, it seems that you are right. Right to feel hurt by the suffering of Pokemon. Right to take Cosmog away. What? It's just Luzamine's dialogue. So we're just beating up a bunch of level 1 Wilmers that a Guzzlord seems to have. I am Luzamine. I am the president of, the founda of this foundation and mother to Gladian and Lily. And while I pour my love into protecting Pokemon and my children from pain, I also try to be strong enough to watch over them without interfering from now on. That could be an even more beautiful kind of love, wouldn't you say? So this is just telling us the story of losing me. Let's just finish off these whalemers. Nakatan, you're doing good. Just keep stomping on those whales. I'll be like a mother to all of those poor Pokemon and shower them with love. Even Pokemon from distant worlds far from the Alola region are worthy of my love. I didn't mean to click that, but whatever. Strong and yet kind. No, perhaps your strength was in fact. In fact, comes from that kindness. Thank you for battling with me. Thank you for being Lily's friend. What the? Oh, it's these seven. Lemon, the lovely one. Orange, the outgoing one. Cherry, the cheerful one. Lime, the little one. Grape, the graceful one. Blueberry, the bubbly one. Strawberry, the sweet one. When all of us join forces, will... What the... You're weak. So how was it? Lemon ring pie, orange parfait, cherry Garcia, lemon lime macaroon, macarons, creamy grape salad, blueberry muffin, strawberry milkshake. Dream about food. That's what I expect from you. <laughs> so I guess it worked. Like I said, I won't be able to do this at the magic show, so don't expect to see it there. But it was still nice to test this out. Maybe in the future I could do environment-based shows. Thanks for coming out here and helping me with this Delisha. I really appreciate it. Now I guess we should head back home. Whoa! Sounds like someone needs help. Let's go find him. Hello? Hey there, are you okay? We heard you screaming. Oh, it's Natalie! I know her! I was lost in here! I was really scared, but I found this shiny Zubat that's been helping me get around. And I remember you, you were in the candy shop the other day. Oh, you met my sister Delisha before? That must have been when she went to explore with Lickitung. 
Happy you're not lost anymore. What are you doing here? I was in Tilburn with my parents, and I kind of wandered off. They go there a lot on business, so that's why we were there. I know you have Zubat to help you, but would you like to, us to tag along to make sure you get back to your parents? I think that I'd like that. Yeah, this cave is dark and scary. Okay, then let's all head back to Tilbjorn. Mommy! Daddy! Daddy, we've been looking all over for you, the, the city for you. Did you get lost in Dark Dungeon? I did, but these nice people in this Zubat saved me. We're glad to see you, okay? Please be careful about wandering off like that, though. You might know all the drones horrible Tilbjorn well enough to get around on your own. The places like caves and forests are completely different from cities. I understand. I'm sorry. It's all right. It's all right. I'm just glad you made it out, okay? Can't thank you two enough for helping find our daughter. And you too, Zubat. <laughs> it's a bit premature since I haven't done anything professional yet, but here's my card. I plan to do a magic show in the, f in the future, so if Natalie ever wants to see one, she could just ask you to contact me. I actually have my first one coming up, but it's in the party district. That sounds wonderful, I'm sure Natalie would love to see one of your shows sometime. I would! I'd like to see you something like that myself. What do you plan on doing with the Zubat, Natalie? Would you like to, get to stay friends with it? Seems like it's taking a shine to you. No pun intended. <laughs> <laughs> if I said that, the pun would be intended. But I think Zubat might want to go with you, Natalie. I want to stay with Zubat too. With Zubat, I'll never get lost again. She pets the Zubat. Well, welcome to the family, Zubat. We should get going now, but thank you so much for helping Natalie out of the cave. And good luck with your magic shows, Felicia. Thanks, and it's no problem. We'll be heading home ourselves. See you around. The next day. That's what the swirl looks. Uh, oh, it's just a marine. And then that's like a tongue, and then that's vanilla. Alright. Good morning, Delicia. Have you already eaten? Candy! I figured. You and your new friends have been eating candy non-stop since you went to the candy shop. I might have sold all that. <laughs> Felicia went out to psych herself up for the show tomorrow. If you're going out too, maybe you'll run into her. So, we're looking for our sister now, okay. Oh, sis, where are you? Okay, oh boy! Delicia, we got tourists trying to sneak in. I guess there's no need to seek around here, we only expected to have to deal with one guard at the entrance. We weren't going to fight if we could help it, but we'd have strength in numbers if we were caught. And you're the girl who defeated me earlier! Have you bowed this person before, Delisha? I was going to ask you to let us handle it. Now that I know that, I trust you to help out. You thought you could win by outnumbering me! I certainly am not invincible. But I wouldn't have been asked to stand guard here if I couldn't deal with a few troublemakers. It's happened a few times a week, actually. You're far from the first to try something like this. Maybe we'll be the first to break through this place's defense, though. I don't know. Maybe we should quit before we get in even more trouble. Even if we can defeat these three, what about the rest of the district? It's all or nothing. Since we come this far, we have to at least try. If we back out now, they'll tighten their security and keep a close eye on us. We won't get another chance like this. Uh, I'm not too sure that's a good idea, but fine. If this girl beat you before, I'll battle her this time. We have to pick our opponents wisely. That's fine with me. You take the guard. Let's show them how we battle in the party district. Yeah, bring it on, Torch Master. Oh, look at the little ski. I'm gonna stomp on it. Stomp on it. I should hopefully kill it. Oh my god, that did nothing! Lick a tongue! How much is that gonna do? Nothing, because Skitty is weak as balls. Right, roll out. Paint the docks! Put that thing with that. It's two roll out. Roll out number three. Yeah, that's getting stronger. Okay. Skitty used roll out. Oh, great. So we're just gonna have to roll out. Now. Oh, look at that. He even gets a crit. Wish we could get a crit. Uh, uh, uh -huh. Yeah. Yeah, beautiful. Wormple. It's staying in use roll out, but kind of, kind of guess we have to. Bug bite, that shouldn't do all that much. Right. Level 100. Done. Alright, uh, let's do this thing with an ice beam. Yeah, I should have known that. One shot the Wormple. Poochie, 
now exiting that. Wow, this vanilla is like broken and overpowered. Now let's hit it with a flash cannon or he knows with a sucker punch. Holy! That was some pretty good top notch. Those are some top notch um, predictions right there. Gianna. Die. This Reef has saved us way too much. Well, absolutely nothing went according to plan. Give me your money. Uh, we'll just leave and not come back. Sorry for the trouble. Thank you both for your help. It's a problem. We shall do our best to make sure no one enters uninvited. I'm glad I can rely on your support. Fortunately, we won't have to deal with them for much long. Er, for get I said that. Wait, what do you mean by that? I said something I wasn't supposed to say. I'm sorry, but I won't give you any more details. I owe you two for helping me out. This is something I can't repay you with. It's okay to help to tell them. They helped us out, so I think they have the right to know. Oh, it's DJ Ultra Beats! Hello, everyone. I heard some commotion, so I came to see what was going on. But it seems like everything's under control now. Thank you all for handling the situation. No need to thank me, ma'am. I was just doing my job. It's Felicia and Delicia here who went out of their way to help me. Anyways, you said it's okay to tell them? Yeah, but not out here in public. Hey, Studson River, welcome to the stream. People will come here wondering about the noise like I did. Felicia and Delicia, if you want to know about the future of the party district, come meet me in the Lightning Lounge. I'll open the doors for you. Where you been? It's been a while. I've been streaming every day, actually, dude. It's just I might have missed a couple days because I've been trying to get my sleep schedule back to being right. It is still not right. <laughs> I'm practically nocturnal now. Okay, we'll meet you there. I'm interested to hear about what this is about. Alright, so lightning lounge. Here we go. Shouldn't go back. I wasn't trying to go backstage. First, I'd like to thank both of you again for helping me out with those trespassers. You heard it from the guard. It won't be... We won't have to deal with them for much longer, and I'm sure you're wondering why that is. It's because the day after your magic show tomorrow, we're going to separate from the rest of Oladrol. I don't mean we're going to sign some government paper saying we're our own city now. I mean, we're going to physically split from the rest of the city. How exactly do you... do we do something like that? I'm going to gather Regirock, Regice, and Registeel to awaken Regigigas. The four of them and, the, and a Pokemon worker crew are going to do it. We're going to be moving to the Yellow Sea, just in front of Victory Road sounds really elaborate. How long have you planned this out? Uh, for a few weeks. The only reason we haven't really done it is because I kept second guessing whether it was necessary. But the number of people trying to sneak into here has been increasing lately, and I think we'd all like to not have to deal with that as much. I haven't told the public because I want to avoid anyone freaking out. I'd rather everyone carry out their lives as usual until it's time to tell them. Seems a bit extreme. But I don't disagree in that we definitely need to do something about people trying to sneak in so often. So how many people know about this other than the guard we talked to? And wouldn't it be best to tell everyone in advance? Nosy knows fast Chelsea and the sailor who's going to get us there by boat after the strip is moved. The guardian of the region and I, ice cream sandwich. Yes, we are back with mac and cheese, only this time... This game is just based on how she got her team. Because we technically beaten Pokemon Spork. Will not spoil if we won the Nuzlocke or not. If you want to see it, you'll have to wait until... Let's see, when does that episode come out? Um, I believe that one comes out on the 1st of December. That's right, I forgot Chelsea was performing next week. I was so focused on my own performance, I hadn't thought about much else. I understand completely. <laughs> Since you know, would you like to come with me? I was going to go alone, but I don't mind having company. Well, that is a lot to take in, but sure, it could be fun. Not to mention, we'll get to meet some legendary Pokemon. Candy? Anytime you want to go to the candy shop, I'll take you there, even if we have to cross the sea to reach it. I need advice. What do you need advice with? Mom and Dad would do the same. Yay! Fantastic. I'll give the speech early in the morning, the day after tomorrow. Then we'll head out. I look forward to seeing your magic show tomorrow, by the way. Thanks. I'll do my best to memorize everything on stage. Delisha, if there's anything 
else you'd like to do an ultra, you should probably do it today. Not that we can't always come back later, of course. It'll just take a bit longer to get there. I was going to head out for a bit today, but I actually think I'll go home so I can process all this. Uh, we don't have really anything else we need to do, so let's head here. I guess we'll just head back home. Yeah, I guess maybe not. Hey, Felicia, I wonder how everyone will react when they hear about what's going to happen. If I were really nervous about my show tomorrow, then this would have made me not nervous anymore. I can understand why DJ Ultra Beats doesn't want people to know until it's time to put the plan into motion, but I think it'd be better for everyone to have more time to prepare. They'll have time to evacuate the district, but their schedules will really be shaken up if they have upcoming plans in other parts of Holodrol. It won't impact us much, but some others might be hit by it hard. We'll all just eventually, though. I know the day just started, but I think I'm already done. If you have any unfinished business in Holodrol, make sure you do it today, or you could rest now if you... Just look forward to a nice show tomorrow. I am indeed looking for the show tomorrow, so let's go jump in bed. Good night. The next day. Good morning, Delicia. It's time for my magic show. When, so when you're ready, head to the Lightning Lounge. Mom and Dad already went there. Hope I do well. All right, Delicia and a Pokemon ate candy for breakfast, like always. Mm, candy. That's nice. And Delicia gathered her Pokemon. Alright, um, Lightning Lounge is right here. HOLY PEOPLE! It sure is crowded, isn't it? We couldn't get a seat, but we'll get to see the show up close, which is even better. Is that Pandora? Oh my god, it's Pandora and the Guardian! Welcome to the Lightning Lounge, everyone! Usually we play music, but today we're having something a little different. Please welcome Felicia, who's going to be performing a magic show for us today. Thank you. This is actually my first time on stage. I didn't expect to see so many famous people here. I'm especially surprised and honored the Guardian himself is here. Hope I'm able to live up to everyone's expectations for my first trick. I switched locations with my Meowstic, who was backstage. Meow! And I'm back. That was one of the first techniques I learned. I can't do it with just anyone, though. It requires effort from both parties. Meowstic and I have constant have to concentrate together. Next, how about some sparkles? This one is an optical illusion made from the light. They, even though the sparkles aren't real, I still think they're pretty. And next, recently I've started experimenting with environment-based magic. I went to Dark Dungeon with my little sister to see if I could make someone have a dream there, and it worked. Since it's environment-specific, I won't be able to do it here today. In fact, I was going to save tricks like that for future shows after I had more time to practice, but I realized I, that I could try one here too. It suddenly got quiet, didn't it? Bet you're wondering where the music went. Here it is. What the hell? Maybe that drastic increase in pitch was too much for your ears. Let's slow it down. If you are in a relationship with someone and they end up having to work ridiculous hours and the last date you had was a now, a month ago, and you want to see them, and they want to see you, what do you do? I don't know, I've never had that, because... What's a relationship? <laughs> All I've had is where I've been treated like a slave. Oh my god, stop it! Personally, I think it's really interesting how the pitch style... The pitch style and instruments used in a song can really change the feel of it cover of a song can have a completely different mood from the original. That's a subject for another time. I'll turn the sound back to normal now. First next one, I need a volunteer. An experienced battler. I've created my own style of battle. Oh boy. Oh, it's in verse type. Okay. My family knows about it, but I haven't shown it to anyone else until now. Let's see. Wendy, would you be willing to help me out here? Me? I'd be honored. Perfect. So this will be a one-on-one -on -one battle. You can use any Pokemon you want. I'll be using Meowstic. It doesn't matter who wins or loses, it just matters that the audience sees the effects of this battle style. Well, this is a disaster. Yeah, I'm sorry I can't help you out, buddy. Meowstic, please enter the stage. Let's battle. It seems, it seems I'm lost. Good game. That battle was very interesting. It wasn't what I expected at all. Hope to see this used more in the future. Be ashamed to limit it just to magic shows. Don't worry. I definitely plan to make more use of it. Thank you for volunteering, buddy. Okay, well, if you want my advice, I'd say maybe... 
um, make like a surprise so the person, like, um, oh, let's see, come up with some plan and just like surprise them. I don't know, where do they work? The show continues for some time. That's all I have for you today. Let's conclude the show with some more sparkles. I'd like to thank my family for encouraging me to perform a show here. I'd like to thank DJ Ultrabeats for allowing me to have this show here at the Lightning Lounge. I'd like to thank my Meowstic for helping me with some of my tricks. And I'd like to thank Wendy and her Lee Banny for volunteering to battle me. And I'd like to thank everyone else for showing up and watching. Hope you all enjoyed this show and I hope to see you at more shows in the future. Thank you for your spectacular display of magic, Felicia. I don't even know what else to do. I suggest that they take off and advance to work even if it's just one day or if someone can cover his shift. Please tell me his job doesn't do that. What is this job exactly? Don't worry, I won't say it out loud on stream. I hope to see you here again for future shows as well. And with the show done, I believe it's time to call it a day. Can't even go back in there. Oh yeah, Chelsea. That's who Chelsea is. I forgot who she was for a minute. But... Wait, did we just head back home? That was an amazing show, Felicia. Everyone loved it. Good job. We knew you had it in what you had in store. But we were still amazed by what we saw. Mm -hmm. Thanks, everyone. Electrician. Oh. That's gonna be a tough one. Hmm. Let's see here. How do you impress one of them? Okay, let's see now. Um. Hmm. How do we get one of them? well myself and that so many celebrities show up i'll work even harder so i can continue to have audiences like that Ronaldo, i think it's time to rest until tomorrow chapter three awakening next day after breakfast the district speakers come online hello residents of the party district i have an important now announcement to make Ooh. what's this music it's kind of creepy This is an event that's been planned out for a while, but that I'm only telling you about as it's close to happening. The party district is going to physically separate from the rest of Oladrol City. I'm going to gather Regirock, Regice, and Registeel to awaken Regigigas and call upon its power. A Pokemon worker crew will also be aiding them in this task. We'll be relocating to the Yellow Sea, and we'll be rebranding ourselves as Party City. We're doing this because of all the people trying to sneak in here who haven't been granted access. Some of you might be happy about this, others might think it's extreme. I wasn't so sure how you'd all react, and that's one reason why I'm t only telling you about this now. I don't want to risk causing a panic. I wanted to give you, I wanted you to go about your, your lives as normal. But the Guardian knows about this plan and had no objections. I'm about to leave now, accompanied by Felicia and Delicia. After the relocation is complete, a sailor will take us all to Party City by boat. Please prepare to evacuate the district. I apologize for the short notice. Thank you for understanding. Maybe I'm worried for nothing, but I'm kind of glad I won't be here to see the initial reaction. I wonder if our parents, how our parents will feel, but I'm not backing out. I still want to go. How about you, Delisha? Ah, schedule scans, I don't care. Yeah, I want to go. I'll take full responsibility if your parents are upset. I'm the one who told you about this and invited you to follow me. We're the ones who agreed to it. You didn't force us to come. You asked if we wanted to. But I know how this goes. 
we'll just keep arguing back and forth about who should take the blame nonstop. And I think we should deal with that when that, when and if that happens. We don't even know whether they'll be upset or not. For now, let's just focus on just on finding those Pokemon. If you're both ready, then so am I. All right, Mount Spoon. Wait, there's one of them here? Okay. So when we played through Spork, we found two of the Reggies. One was in Ice Cream Sandwich's ca Castle Palace room. That was Reg Ice. Over in the desert down, uh, wait, why can't, why can't I move? Oh, there we go. Down here is uh, Reggie Rock. So what are we doing here? Is Registeel here maybe? Are you pouring lemonade on this rock? Registeel really likes lemonade. Normally it hangs out further up in the mountains, but it'll come down here if it smells lemonade. Lemonade! We were just talking about you, Registeel. DJ Ultra Beats, I haven't seen you in a long time. How have you been? I overheard from Elumia that you're a gym leader now. So, are you still challenging the league, or did you get offered a gym leader position and settled on that? Becoming a gym leader was my goal from the beginning. I just battled the leaders to make a name for myself before I made a deal with Stryker. I won our battle, and so I became the new electric leader. But if Stryker didn't accept the deal, I guess I would have gone to the challenge the Elite Four. I wonder how that would have ended. That is why I really wanted, though. So I'm happy about how things turned out. It sounds like a lot happened while I've been messing around up in the mountains. So what brings you here? Today. Whoa, you're really doing all that? It sounds kind of excessive, but I'm full on board if the Guardian is. Just let me drink this lemonade first. Of course, I poured it for you. Thank you for the amazing lemonade. I am ready to move a city. Great, let's go meet Regirock next. Yep, here he is. Oh boy, this is gonna be a fun one. He likes the rap. Actually, can we get our encounter here yet? I mean, we're not doing a Nuzlocke. Oh, you do fight! My seal and spiel will show you that we're the real deal. Alright, let's take this seal out with a good power whip. I should probably sell all those Pokeballs I bought. <laughs> thinking, oh, I can catch some things, so let's find them. <laughs> nope, we can't. There's no encounters. Now Spiel's coming out, so we're gonna hit with the power whip. Okay, okay, okay. Alright. I think I've come up with an idea. So, call the place, and be all like, something is going on with the electricity and you need it checked. When they arrive, do whatever you feel like you gotta do, my dude. If you understand what, what I'm, if you're picking up what I'm putting down. I don't know how to feel. It's like I slipped in on a banana peel. Can we go see Hoopa? You should go to where Regirock and the others are. But I don't want to. I want to see Hoopa. Alle Hoopa ring. All right. I see I've been approached by an exploration team in this hot desert. You do well to have an ice cream. How'd you know I was thinking that? Okay, let's try another. Nobody wants to face me in my scuffle. My sturdy rocks will make both seem stuff as a chocolate truffle. Again, you're just making lucky guesses. Or are you very good at this? If my rhyming ability, there's always an uptake. I think after this, I'll have a cupcake. I say, you know, one of it's like you know what I'm just going to say before I say it. Or maybe my punchlines are just that obvious. Either way, since Registeel is here, I'm guessing you all have something important to tell me. Yes, we have a plan. You seriously want to do that? Well, if it's fine with the Guardian, I guess it's fine with me. We only need to find Red Ice now. Hello, Ice Cream Sandwich. Hi, I've been waiting for you. Looks like you've already found Reggie Rock and Registeel. I didn't expect you to bring human company too, though. I was going to come alone, but Delisha and Felicia helped out with some trespassers, so I decided to fill them in. I asked they wanted to come, so they decided to tag along. 
I see. Nice to have you here, then. Your magic show was amazing, by the way, Felicia. Thanks. I plan to perform more in the future. I look forward to it. Regis is in the room to your left. Oh, Synthastasia! Hi, Synthastasia! Just uh, I have <laughs> Didn't Ice and Cream Sandwich let you know about what's going on? Yes, she did, but... I seem to only be able to get up early when I don't have anything to do. Something important's happening. I usually have trouble getting to sleep at a good time. I'm not sleeping in. Sorry, but could I please have some time to wake up? Maybe once you... Maybe one of you could battle Ice Cream Sandwich while you're waiting. I'm sure she wouldn't mind. Okay, I understand. We'll give you some time to get, to get adjusted. Does anyone want to battle Ice Cream Sandwich? Oh, great. So we're going to fight her. This would be a great opportunity for you to get stronger. Your first battle against a famous trainer. Since you're new, I'm sure she'll play to your level. But she's still really good, so stay on your toes. If you'd like me to, I could try the move to that doesn't teach moves to your Pokemon if you feel like it might need some good ones. Give you some supplies too. Citrus berries, those could be helpful. Full restores, those will be helpful too. Did she give us three citrus berries? Yes, she did. Good. We're gonna give one to each of our level 100s. Oh, I wish they could just evolve. Why could they have to be level 100s? And we just can't evolve. I love like a nice level 100 Vanellux and level 100 Shiny Ampharos. And maybe a level 100 Licky Licky. I heard everything from the room. I'll be happy to battle you while Regice gets ready. Since you have three Pokemon, I'll use three Pokemon too. Let's make this a fun battle. Alright, Ice Cream Sandwich. Snow Run. Alright, let's try Rollout. So if I remember correctly, you were the original Ice Gym Leader, and you also were the original Fairy Gym Leader. So she should run Fairy and Ice types. And we missed a Rollout. That's... that's... Good job, Tonger. Alright. Doing decent damage, I'd say. There's the Citrus Fairy. Forgot we had that. Ice Beam. I'm surprised you're not even using Crunch. Right, come on, do some decent damage. Okay. Um. Yeah, there goes Tonger. Which I knew would happen. What pink will fight this one? With a nice Silver Star with a Power Gem. Okay, stop. Thank you. A lowland bullpit. Okay. Oh, it's so cute! Look at the adorable thing! Ah, I just want to snuggle it! Oh, it has Moonblast. Is it like an egg move for these things? I feel like it is. The fact that it's also hidden ability makes this thing more worrying. Oh, there goes Pink Wolf. Whoa. So I'm honestly just still waiting for, the, for her to send out her fairy type. That's why I saved Gelato for last. So we're just gonna flash again in the rest of her team. Ow, 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 stop it. There goes that. There's the fairy type. It's Of course, it's really one. It's play rough. Armor. That's gonna do a bit more than I would have liked. All right, come on, Flash Cannon, do decent damage. Maybe I should just use Ice Beam. All right. Actually, since the hail is still going, we're gonna heal with one of those full restores that we managed to get our hands on. Or yeah, full restore. We're gonna hope Energy Ball won't do too much. Oh, that did about half. Oh, it's gonna use Blizzard, but we'll just use Ice Beam this time. Nice! We beat her. You knew, but you already battled well. Congratulations for your victory. Here's an ice cream sandwich. Ice cream sandwich gives Delicia an ice cream sandwich. Yee! We happily eat it. Maybe Red Ice will be ready now. If not, we can always battle again. Well, let me heal. Glad she didn't use Synthastasia. <laughs> we heard what happened from here. Congratulations on winning. I'm very impressed with you. You've come a long way in such a short amount of time. <laughs> I clicked off game. Uh, I don't care about risks on my computer. Stop popping this stuff up. 
The feeding ice cream sandwich is definitely a feat. Even if she wasn't going all out. Nice job. I think I'm fully awake now. Let's go meet Regigigas. There he is. Computer startup noises. Hang on, I, I got this covered. Hold on, guys. Um. <laughs> oh, man. I, I have to do this. Uh. Alright, you guys, you, guys, you guys are gonna hate me for this so much. <laughs> well, that didn't work. Never mind. We'll find a different one. Uh, this is not working at all. Actually, I got it. me Never mind, it's not working. Sorry guys, uh, startup noises. Hello my children, it is nice to see you again, and hello to your human companions as well. What can I assist you? The three Reggies explain the situation Reggie. Interesting, an event like that will go down in history, I imagine. And if it has the Guardian's endorsement, all that's left to do is actually do it. I'm really, I'm ready, willing, and able. Let's make our way to Olajul. Holy! Here we go! Good whatever time of day it is for you viewers, I'm Nosy Nosepass, here live as the separation of the party city is starting. As you may have already heard from DJ Ultra Beat's announcement, the party district is going to relocate to the Yellow Sea and become Party City. DJ Ultra Beat's decided to do this because of all the trespassers sneaking in and the Guardian has approved of the plan. DJ Ultra Beats, would you like to say something to the viewers? I've said pretty much everything I need to say during my announcement to the party district. I guess I could reiterate that I'm sorry for the short notice and for any schedules I messed up, but I really do believe that this is for the best. Okay, thank you for your time, DJ Ultrabeats. Several hours later. Welcome everyone aboard the SS Friendship. <laughs> <laughs> this is your captain speaking. We're currently heading towards Party City, which is located in the Yellow Sea. This will take some time, so please go to the kitchen and get some of our chef's, chef's delicious food. You can talk to your friends and family in the friend area located to the right of the kitchen. If you'd like to gaze at the sea, you can also go to the back of my ship. Enjoy yourself until we reach Party City. And remember, we're all friends here on this ship. This is your captain, over and out. I guess all, us, all of us have a lot of catching up to do. I should see what everyone thinks about the plan before we reach the city. If they're upset with me, I can't avoid facing them forever, so I might as well deal with it now. And you do have to meet with your parents to see how they're feeling. 
Best of luck to all of you. Well, I first want to get some food. Sometimes I have to resist the temptation of eating my own food. But all the guests have gotten their meals now, so I guess we can dig in here. There was a family of three who got four plates. They said they were waiting for a pink haired girl. Might that be you? Yep. Your family would be in the friend area then. They already got your food for you. Wow. Really comp Really nice parents. Dang it, I was hoping there'd be leftovers in those garbage cans. Oh, this boat looks so nice. Uh, where are- here they are. Give me that spaghetti! We missed you, Delisha. We already got your food, so feel free to eat. Thank you! Oh, just to eat all the plates and stuff. DJ Ultrabeats was just explaining everything to Mom and Dad. We were worried for nothing. They aren't upset at all. It sounds like you two have been through a lot. Those kind of experiences will help you grow. Everything took us by surprise, but nothing bad happened, so why be upset? We were just about to explain that we understand why no one can tell us. As international police agents, we can't discuss mission details with anyone, so we've been on the same boat before. In fact, we're literally all on the same boat now. We sure are. Wait, what? They're... they're international police members? Do you know Looker? <laughs> well, I guess... I'm glad all of you understand. I think I should address everyone else here, too. People are looking at me like they're waiting for me to give some kind of speech, and I think I owe them one. Good day, residents of Party City and fellow friends of, on the friendship. I know I kind of left right after my announcement, and I'm sure some of you have things you'd like to say or things you'd like me to say. I know it takes some time to get used to this change, and some of you might be affected more than others. Some of you have friends in other parts of Aldril that you won't be able to see as often. Some of you may have had to cancel business meetings or other arrangements. We won't be close to the services district anymore, which means the department store is across the sea instead of a short walk away. We'll have to go pretty far if we want to drink at the Twilight Tavern or partake in Pokemon contests too. There's definitely going to be some inconveniences, but I did what I believed to be our best interest in the long term. We can get used to nothing, to not having all of those places. Every other city in Seoul still does fine without them, and we can make our own replicas. We can still talk to our friends on the phone and online, and I'm sure as captain, the captain would be happy to ferry people back and forth to meet up in person. But to people trying to sneak in, I don't know about any of you, but that's not something I ever got used to. The number of people doing it increased over time, and my patience with them decreased even faster. I even doubted many times whether this action was necessary, but I reached the conclusion that it was. If there's any questions or concerns you have, feel free to bring them up, and I'll do my best to answer. And if you have any, if, if any of you want to leave and would prefer to live in Olajol, I ask the captain to take those of you back to Olajol once we reach our destination. Somebody on. There's no need to worry, DJ Ultra Beats. We're all pretty much agree with you. It's like you said. It takes time to get used to not having some things, but we'll have to learn to adapt in a few months. I'm just glad we won't have to deal with trespassers anymore. You might keep us up at night sometimes with your music, but at least music is nice to listen to. It's not nice to hear people being thrown out and causing trouble. We don't blame them for wanting in, but this is invite only, and we, and they haven't been invited. Well, that's a relief to hear. Thank you all so much for understanding. I don't really consider myself as being a leader since I really just want to have fun and see everyone else having fun too. So I was really anxious about all of this. <laughs> But I'm glad I did something that everyone actually wanted. I think I'm going to explore the ship for a bit. And if you need me or anything, don't hesitate to ask. Speaking of exploring the ship, I think I'm going to see the ocean view from the back. You're welcome to come if you want, Alicia. Okay, we'll be here if you need us. Let's go check it out. Holy Faramosas! A toast to fabulous fashion. Three stylish dressers and three Faramosas. Faramosa are stylish Pokemon themselves. Maybe they're not con, con Maybe it's not coincidence we were all drawn together. Oh, hello there. We didn't see you two. Your magic show was as stylish as our outfits, Felicia. There's no doubt about that, that this is something to make a record of in the data vault. I'm really glad you think so. Truthfully, I didn't expect so many high-profile individuals to attend. We three are the most frequent visitors to the Lightning Lounge. We got to support everyone brave enough to get there on stage. As your bravery paid off, I'm even considering making an outfit based on those sparkles you showed us. 
and I'll be even more than happy to do a photo shoot in that outfit. Anything that's sparkly is my aesthetic. Felicia blushes at having her magic praise so highly from so many legendaries. Oh, the, 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 the height! Yeah, I forgot you had a, a damn Zergatry. Stupid Zergatry killing like half our team. Is this an Ultra Beast party or Pheromosa only? <laughs> Felicia, Delicia, DJ Ultra Beats, The Guardian, Pandora, Wendy, Zergatry, and the three Pheromosas hung out and watched the ocean until. This is your captain speaking! Reach Party City, so prepare to disembark. Thank you for being my friends on this voyage, and I hope we to sail with you again. There we go, Party City. This looks so much more familiar now. Uh, let's just head home. Oh my God, our home is destroyed! Oh, it's crashing! <laughs> oh no, no, it's doing the spark. It's pulling a spark, my guys. No! Don't crash! Please? Please? Please don't crash. Come on. The script is... And it crashed. The script is saying... Okay. You know what? We are just going to end that YouTube episode right there with the crash. <laughs> Thank you all so much for watching. If you like the button... If you like the video, hit the like button over there. And if you're new to the channel, why not hit the subscribe button down below? Thank you all, and I'll see you all in the next episode. Bye-bye.